projects for Don Bell. Oh, oh, um, di ko alam kung pwede magsalita eh, pero Meron. we have something in store. Okay. That's all you I know? can say. Okay, mega abangan para sa Don Bell, Katie Lex. Same. Same. Okay. <laughs> yeah, same. Yeah, I, yeah, have, I hope you understand, uh, Rema. We love our jobs. Yes. <laughs> so, but what else we in? We cannot hopefully, say. Hopefully, ano more music po. If since we can talk about upcoming shows, but thankfully there will be a follow up. Um. But what we can share is uh, we'll be making more music for sure. Uh -huh. The good thing is, meron, me yes. abangan pa, okay? Yes. Uh, I remember my mind. Ano remember ko yung? <laughs> <laughs> next project. Okay, take a look. Inita. Yan. Um, next project po. Siguro pwede naman na po yata sabihin. Nagfocus po talaga ako ngayon sa pagperform at may may bagong album po na talagang namang kabugera din. Yay! No pressure, guys! <laughs> hindi kasi, isa talaga sa mga nagustuhan ko sa pagpo-perform, hindi ka lang kasi dito nagpo-perform sa Pilipinas, kundi magbibigay din ako ng, ng, ng ano po? Ay, akala ko ako yung sinas. Uh, magbibigay din ako ng saya sa iba't ibang, um, sa iba't ibang, ano tawag na Tagalog, no? Sa iba't ibang sulok ng mundo. So, ayun, excited ako talaga. Okay, Charlie. Yes, ako po may upcoming movie po ako. Isushoot ko pa lang po sa August after po ng US tour namin. So, sana po abangan ninyo. Yan. And Zanjo, mga projects in the future. Uh, after ng US tour, siguro abangan nyo yung nagawa siguro ako ng TikTok account. Hindi, <laughs> 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 mag-start na po ako ng bagong series after ng The Broken Marriage Vow. Uh, Patungkol sa TikTok. Yung Dirty Linen, abangan niyo po yan. Ah, yes. Uh, kasama ko po si Miss Janine Gutierrez at marami pang iba. Alright. Okay. Miss Rema? Yes. Uh, Robby, may isang tanong lang ako. Yeah. Para ikaw na rin na pumili ng, ng artist kung sino yung pwede niyo sumagot. What kind of entertainment can we expect from uh, this show? Saka ano yung inspiration putting up this concert? I think the best one who can answer that this, of course, marami man sabi lahat, no? But, uh, Bell. Um, of course, what you can expect is that we're gonna bring home to you guys there in abroad. You know, we've been wanting to see you guys there for so long and now we are given the opportunity to finally, like what I said earlier, put smiles on your faces and just share what we have and share our talents with you guys. So, yun yung my expect nyo. And our best, of course. Celebration of excellence here in Star Magic. Try for excellence. Yep. Um, Edward. Uh, of course, this is the, the 30th anniversary of, of Star Magic. This is something that has been not just two years since the pandemic started, but 30 years in the making and even more so um, throughout all of our lives. So you can expect, like uh, Tulay Nishanabe ni Bell, that we're going to be bringing a slice of home, uh, siyempre. Yung mga mahilig mag-English, magtatagalog. Yung mga mahilig magtagalog, mag-English. Tulay ni Kuya Eric. Di ba, yeah. Eric? When I was a child. <laughs> <laughs> but just more fun. More fun on the way and more memories. Uh, yan ang ma, ma, uh, mapapromise namin. We'll give you a memory to hold on to. Thank you, Miss Rema, for that question. Thank you and congratulations. Yeah, thank you. Maraming maraming salamat. Ito naman si Jeffrey Perdon of Kapamilya Online World. Jeffrey, are you here with us? <laughs> Ba't nasa kalesa? Hey, Jeffrey. Jeffrey? Okay. Itatanong ko na lang yung katanungan ni Jeffrey para kay Charlie Dizon. Uh, according to Shanti, si Chantal uh, Videla, isa ka raw sa nag-introduce sa kanya sa K-pop. Ano yung na-feel mo about sa success niya na makapag-debut sa isang K-pop group? Kung mabigyan ka ng panibagong pagkakataon ngayon, ipupursue mo pa rin ba ang pagiging isang K-pop idol? Uh, siguro po, ano, ako super happy ako na na-launch si Chantal kasi yun din yung naging dream ko dati and nakita ko yung journey niya kung paano siya pumasok din sa K-pop world. As in, message niya ako before tapos pinacheck niya sa akin yung contract na in-offer sa kanya if ganun ba talaga. And kaya na na-launch na siya. Ang saya-saya ko, parang proud ate kasi kapatch ko siya nung nilaunch kami ng Star Magic 2018. And also yung MLB, yung company niya, 
dinamessage din ako if I can help na i-promote si Chantal, ganyan. Nung mga times pa lang na nilalabas siya sa mga music video, yung hindi pa siya nilalaunch talaga as K-pop idol. And um, siguro, ngayon, kung bibigyan ako ng chance ng K-pop Charlie. Charlie. Oh, yeah, yeah, Charlie. Ay, sorry. Ayan, okay. okay. Na the last na nahar namin, K. Kung may bigyan ka ng chance sa <laughs> uh, maging K. Ay, hindi. Okay, so, if may bigyan ako ng chance maging K-pop idol, uh, nahihiya ako kasi hindi ko alam kung kaya ko pa yung training nila kasi sobrang tagal talaga yung nahaba ng training. Pero if given a chance na malunch ako, why not, di ba? Siguro more on K-drama actress na lang. Ganun. Wow. Wow. Uh-huh. Okay, maraming maraming salamat for answering that one. And up next, um, online na magtatanong sa atin si Kuya Jun Rigonan of Rated J Singapore. I miss you, Kuya Jun. Kuya Jun? I don't miss you. <laughs> Jun Rigonan of Rated J Singapore. Maybe later on, matatanong natin si Kuya Jun at makasama po natin siya. Pero for now, I'll be asking this question coming from Christine Bailon of Pep.ph. Question for Donny Pangilinan. How do you feel na extended ang He's Into Her Season 2 despite its limited reach on free TV? And how excited are you to meet your fans, Madon Bell, abroad? Of course, we were super thrilled to know that it was extended to Season 2. But more than that, yung Season 1, 10 episodes lang, Kuya Robs. Itong, epi- itong Season 16 episodes. So I think actually people expected na maging 10 din to. And then when they found out it was more, they were also thrilled. Like I said a while ago, it doesn't end with the US. But of course, magkita namin yung mga fans namin dyan. But after that, we go for the finale of He's Into Her dito sa Araneta, uh, end of August. So just to have it all come full circle, uh, remembering where we were two, three years ago um, when He's Into Her was first announced, grabe lang yung buong journey namin lahat um, as a group, as a cast, uh, with Direk and all the producers, the uh, the crew, everyone. Uh, we've gone through so much and it's nice that we get to also um, celebrate in this way uh, with the supporters as well. I think it's high time for me to ask a question then after season two. Magkakaroon ba ng season 3 sa Benison? Uh, <laughs> muna si Max and Dave siguro kasi may iba ding gagawin uh, kami ni Bell. Okay. So, okay. yun muna. Yun but muna. open to that possibility. We'll see. We'll see. I don't know yet. We'll see. Oh, okay. Uh, we'll talk see. about it. <laughs> okay, okay. Abangan natin yan. Ito naman si Charmy Joy Pagulong from the Philippine Star who has a wonderful question. To Zanjo and Mai Mai. How do you want your performance or performances to be remembered and what makes you inspired recently? Hindi naman ako performer, mo na ka na ba eh. Uy, naiyan naman ako sa'yo. Sabi niyo, sir, magkakanta kayo. Mag, ano kayo, dancing, dancing kayo. <laughs> Anong inspiration mo ba? Ayan. Ayan. Ang inspiration ko po talaga sa... Pag- Nasa Canada. <laughs> <laughs> Pinakagtong <laughs> lady in pink na to. Yes po. Ang inspirasyon ko po talaga sa, sa pag-perform, uh, siguro po talaga yung mga taga-support ako, since sila naman po talaga yung nag, nag-push sa akin na mas mahalin ko pa yung, yung ginagawa ko. At true enough po, um, nung una nga, talagang kagaya na sinabi ko, sobrang nahirapan talaga ako siyang i-embrace yung binigay ni Lord sa akin. Pero... Yun nga, paunti-unti kapag pinag-aaralan mo siya, unti-unti na-embrace mo siya, unting nagiging, tas paunti-unti nagiging, na-enjoy mo siya. At ayun, sila yung inspiration ko, yung mga kapamilya na sumusuporta sa akin, yung pamilya ko, yung Panginoon, at yung mga mahal ko po sa buhay. Okay. Um, Zanjo? Uh, Nakaka-excite din kasi tagal ko na rin hindi nakakatapak sa stage, di ba, para mag-perform sa mga kapamilya natin dito sa Right, like sa ASAP, tapos ngayon naman sa, sa abroad. Um, siguro nakakatuwa to dahil ito yung trabaho na parang walang pressure na nararamdaman. Diba? Parang hindi ka napipressure, parang gusto gusto mo nang pumunta, gusto mo nang gawin, gusto mo nang mag-perform o kasi para ma-meet yung mga tao, yung mga kababayan natin. Ewan ko, ganun yung pakiramdam ko pag, pag gantong, gantong event yung ipapasukin ko. Wala akong pressure na nararamdaman kasi excited ako. 
na magpasalamat at makita yung 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 ngiti at saya ng mga kapamilya natin abroad. Yeah. I want to push the question further if that's okay no. Kasi si Zanjo kasi nasa uh, legacy stage na. You're just uh, one of the best actors right here yes. in the Philippines right now. But, and someone agreed. Yes, sabi, di ba? Uh, Z, uh, how do you want to be remembered as an actor, as a performer? As a kapamilya? Um, <laughs> ano ba? Siguro ano? Siguro sa every character na gagawin ko, uh, ayun, bad, good, or kahit ano man yan, uh, sana sana makapag-inspire, di ba? Makapag-iwan ako ng lesson sa lahat ng mga characters na gagawin ko. And, ayun, siguro sana kung hanggang saan man ako abutin dito sa industriya nito, sana yun, ang maalala nila is yung yun, yung isang simpleng taga-probinsya na umabot ng pangarap at alam mo yun, na naabot niya sa sa pamamagitan ng pakikisama, ng, ng uh, pakikinig at uh, willing matuto. Simple man with uh, not so simple dreams at yung talent na beyond the stars talaga. All right, thank you Z. Uh, let's ask Kuya Jun if he's here already. Kuya Jun, operated J Singapore. <laughs> oh nga bukas July na no. Kuya Jun, maybe you can uh, message your questions and we'll get back to you via an email soon. Um and our last question will be coming from Marco Polo Demo. Sequento ni Toto.com. Question for Andrea Brillantes. With all of your past successful projects, what is beyond your star? Anong plano with your career? Anong plano mo with your career? Um, sa ngayon po, kakatapos ko lang din mag-film for a musical series. Nakasama ko din yung si AC and si Kyle na makakasama ko din dito sa US tour. And, um, pero na din po mga nakaplano kasi hindi ko din po pwede pang sabihin. But I'm really excited kasi isa po to sa mga pinapangarap ko talagang role. Um, ayun lang naman po. And continuous pa rin naman yung pagiging vlogger ko sa YouTube. Bilang content create, bilang tiktokerist. <laughs> um, patuloy pa rin naman po at hanggat sa meron pa rin trabaho na binibigay sa akin at opportunity, tinatanggap ko at lagi ko pa rin po binibigay yung best ko. Every day. May follow-up question daw dito. Uh, kasama rin daw ba siya sa plano mo? Sino Uy! siya? Ay, bahala ka, hindi ko alam kung sino siya. Kanina ka pa Kuya Robby ah. Bakit ka pa ka naman? <laughs> Kanina ka pa ha. Tinatanong ko lang naman. Sina lang ako oh, nag-talk dito eh. Ayun oh, naman pala. Ay, kaya, kaya. <laughs> Oh, ayan. Pero ang gusto namin, eh, siyempre, mapanood ang uh, performances ng ating Star Magic Artists. That's the last question. Palapangan po natin Whoa. ang ating elite Star Magic Artists. And thank you for all of your wonderful questions, our friends from the media. Now, on behalf of our beautiful artists right here, uh, maybe Kuya Eric and Zanjo can invite all of the kababayans, all of our kapamilyas to watch and uh, get a ticket para para dito itong one of a kind concert na to. We got yes. three legs. Yes. Katulad na sinabi mo, one of a kind. Kasi two years pong nawala. Imagine, 24 months kayong uh, nasabik. Kami rin nasabik. Ito yung kumbaga sa lobo, pinuno mo ng tubig. Pagkatapos biglang sasambulat. Tapos maraming surpresa na nabas. Yan, yan. Abangan nyo po po eh. Ah, abangan nyo po kami dyan. Promise yan. Mag-enjoy kayo. Thank you, Kuya Eric. Zanjo! Yes, sigurado. Kay Eric pa lang, mga kababayan. Mag-enjoy <laughs> na kayo. Paano pa, di ba? Kung hahaluan pa natin ng isang napakagandang production number sa buong Star Magic Artist. Kaya, yun. Magkita-kita po tayo dyan. Excited na po kami. At, uh, yun. See you guys. We'll see you there. Um, in six weeks, di ba? Yung iba sa amin dito, naka-empake na. Handa nang lumipad. Let's yung iba, go! May ticket na, pero kung hindi nyo makontain yung excitement nyo, wag po kayong mag-alala um, dahil you better stay tuned sa ating social media accounts to follow all the prep and hard work that goes beyond the scenes. Starting July 8, that is next week, we'll take you on this exclusive access every Friday at 6 p.m. as we bring you the Journey to Beyond the Stars docuseries on July 23 at 8 p.m. It's going to be the Beyond the Stars kickoff at the Newport Performing Arts Theater in Resorts World. Manila. Okay, for tickets, call SM Tickets 
at 8470-2222. And again, Beyond the Stars US Tour, August 6 at King's Theater, New York. August 12 at the War Field, San Francisco. And August 14 at Saban Theater, Los Angeles. Tickets are available at mytfc.com slash starmagic30. The Star Magic Beyond the Stars US Tour is presented by World Remit and brought to you by Tansinko Law. Once again, maraming salamat sa ating wonderful artists right here. And we'll see you very, very soon sa ating Star Magic Beyond the Stars US Tour. I'm Robbie Domingo, and the magic continues here sa ating Star Magic. Good morning.